chirpy, despite the journey up. Tell me a bit. You were telling me earlier that you weren't happy with the new single. Why? Um, difficult question. It was possibly not supposed to say this. Uh, well, it's not really um, a definite representation of the music that we're sort of writing now. It's more, more sort of the old stuff we were writing. So we're not really that pleased it was released. You're also saying that Paul Young's recorded one of your songs, but that you'd like to do it. Yeah, he's done, uh, covered our second single, which was Pale Shelter. Um, but I don't think he's going to release it. We hope to. How come you'd be willing to do that, which is an old song, and, and you're, you're not happy with the new single? Well, we've re-recorded it, and it sounds a lot better. In one of your interviews this week, you've said that you're more interested in um, promoting symbols than yourselves as people. What sort of symbols? That was a lie, actually. Yeah. <laughs> All right, be like we're that, more, be like that. We're more interested in promoting ourselves as people. Okay. Oh. So that's, that's for this week, anyway. Next week, it'll be different. How do you think, um, with, the, with the single coming out that you're not particularly happy with, do you think that you were sort of manipulated, or do you think you just, it just happened? I think it was a very natural occurrence. It just happened. Now tell me a bit about the video which we're about to be seeing in about a minute. Well this guy approached us called Clive Richardson and he said I'd really like to produce your new video. And we said yeah well what have you done? He said I did your last one. And I said that's funny because I thought I recognised you. And he said I got this really good location to do it. Yeah. London. Have you yeah. ever been there? Yes, yes I've been there. Yeah. That's it, really. You told me there was a big saga behind the video. Not at all. Oh. Right, so we'll have to wait with bated breath for that. What are you going to be doing in the future? Um, well, we just finished our, our first album, and we're now rehearsing to go on tour in March with a snot covered handkerchief. So, until then, you have to wait with bated breath to see them on tour, and now we have the wonderful video with no story behind it from Tears for Fears. It's changed.